at binigagawa naman tayo ng ating chicken and mushroom creamy pasta recipe. So, ingredients natin, chicken breast na hinati-hati natin. We have cream, kaya nga creamy, di ba? And cornstarch, uh, that's about two tablespoons. Gagawin natin slurry yan mamaya para maging mas lalo creamy yung ating pasta. We have parsley, white onions, mushroom, of course. Ang uh, ginagamit ko ngayon ay sticks and stems. Usually, nilalagyan ko pa ito ng shiitake, kaya lang wala ako ngayon. Kaya gagawin natin dalawang can na lang ng mushroom. We have white wine and butter and a little bit of olive oil to fry the chicken. So, ang first step natin ay ipapan fry natin yung ating chicken breast hanggang, hanggang maging slightly brown. So, while we're waiting for our butter and olive oil to heat a little, a little more, okay, gawin natin, ipapat dry natin tong ating chicken para hindi siya masyadong mailagsik pag pinirito natin. Yan. Siyempre, masarap pag may butter. Kaya nga, ilalagyan natin ng olive oil para hindi masunog yung butter because butter always has a lower boiling temperature at magbabrown agad yan. So, ngayon, ilalagay na natin yung ating mga manok for frying. So, binaliktan na natin yung ating chicken. Makita nyo, brown na yung some side niya. Now, the purpose for that is para mas seed yung flavor ng chicken. Para mas masarap siya pag kinalo natin sa ating creamy sauce. So, luto na ating first batch ng chicken. At uh, nasa pan na yung ating second and last batch. Mga pala, you know, yung chicken kasi may salmonella siya so advisable talaga pag maghihiwa kayo ng anything that's poultry sana meron kayong sariling shopping board hiwalay para sa chicken hiwalay para sa meat at saka vegetables para safe yung ating family so pagka prito ng manok lalagay na natin yung ating white onions dun sa pinagprituan ng pan para makuha niya lahat ng drippings at ma- of course, ma-absorb niya lahat ng flavor. So, we're gonna do this until lumambot or mag maging translucent yung ating onion. Okay, so medyo translucent na yung ating onions. Pwede na natin ilagay yung ating mushrooms. So, like I said kanina, usually nilalagyan ko ito ng shiitake together with the canned mushrooms. Kaya lang pagtingin ko sa ref, wala na. So, pwede na rin yan, canned mushrooms. Because usually, mas you know, it kind of holds its texture more than the regular fresh shiitake mushroom. Medyo madami yan kasi gusto talaga namin ng mushrooms. So, papansin nyo, parang nawala na halos lahat ng drippings nung pinagpituhan ng chicken natin. So, nasipsip na ng onions at garlic at uh, ng mushrooms natin yan. Kaya napakasarap na yan. Pero just to be sure na nating glaze talaga natin yan at para sumara pa ang ating pasta, lagyan natin siya ng white wine. Okay. So, may alcohol yan. But as you know, as the wine boils, yung alcohol evaporates at ang matitira dyan, yung flavor na lang ng grapes. Kaya masarap yan. So at this point, lalagyan natin siya ng water. Ang ginagamit ko dito yung sabaw noong mushroom sa lata. About one cup. And lalagyan natin ng chicken cube. Yan ang great substitute pag wala tayong chicken stock. My ever-dependable chicken cube. So we'll let that simmer. And while it's simmering, like I always say, kailangan nakalayer ang flavor. So lalagyan natin ng konting salt and pepper. 
Kaya ang ating kumulo. At this point, pwede na natin idagdag yung ating cream. Mga kulang pa siya. So, nagdagam pa natin. Busin na nga natin. Wala na laman. <laughs> so, ayan natin muna maluto yung cream. Pagkatapos nyo, nakakalo na natin yung ating chicken. Okay. So, pwede na natin ihalo yung ating chicken na pinan-fry natin kanina. Then we'll let it simmer. So our chicken has been simmering for the past uh, two, three minutes or so. Mga pala isang tip, no? Habang, kunyari, ganyan, nagpapasimmer kayo and while waiting, it's a great time for you to start cleaning or washing. Ako kasi clean as you go, eh. Para hindi ako natatambakan ng mga hukugasan. Para pagkatapos nyo magluto, sobrang bare, bare minimum na lang yung hukugasan ninyo. Like, for me, Ang matitira na lang siguro itong chopping board ko at saka itong ramekin na may corn starch slurry which incidentally ay ilalagay na natin. Kung mapapansin nyo, medyo while it's creamy, hinahanap mong consistency dyan yung medyo malapot para kumapit talaga siya dun sa pasta later on, di ba? So meron tayong ditong corn starch slurry which is made up of corn starch and water at ilalagay na natin siya. Para lumapot yung ating sauce. Yan, kita mo, lumalapot na siya. Very good. At this point, ito na yung best time for you to taste it and adjust the flavoring. Okay na siya for me. And the last thing we need to do is add our fresh parsley. Yeah, sarap niyan. Okay, let's uh, give it some aroma and flavor. Okay, so patay na natin para malu maluluto rin naman yung parsley dyan sa heat. Mapapansin nyo nagtira ako ng parsley, gagamitin natin yan mamaya sa ating pasta. I'll show you how. Okay, so our pasta sauce is ready and our pasta is cooking. At mamaya maya, we'll bring it together for you. Okay, so luto na yung pasta natin. As always, nagtira tayo ng konting pasta water sa pot para maging mas masarap yung ating sauce. Now at this point, what we're gonna do is put our parsley in sa ating pasta. We're gonna mix that. Bago natin ihalo yung ating chicken and mushroom sauce. The reason we do this is magkakaroon ng ibang fragrance yung ating pasta dish overall. So may pasta yung pasta natin may parsley at yung ating sauce ay syempre may parsley din. So at this point, dinagdag na natin yung ating chicken and mushroom pasta sauce at iahalo na natin sa ating pasta. Okay, so there you have it. Ang ating creamy chicken and mushroom pasta. So easy to make. Hope you enjoy it.